Hi guys, welcome back. This is Maths 3000. Today I'm going to show you how to work out the standard deviation from a list of numbers. So there is no frequency involved. So our standard deviation can be found using the formula in the red box. So it's the square root of sigma x squared divided by n minus in the bracket sigma x divided by n close your bracket squared and n is the amount of numbers in the list and sigma means sum of and x are our data values so let's have a look at the example that we have here so we've got to work out the standard deviation of the ages of these four people so we've got abby is six billy is 12 charlie is five daisy is seven so first of all then we need to try and get these key values in our formula so the first one that we have is n so we have four people so n is four okay the next thing i'm going to do then is work out sigma x so this is the sum of all the ages of the people that we have so if we call the age x so to get sigma x we just need to add up our numbers here so 6 add 12 add 5 add 7 gives a total of 30 so we now need to work out sigma x squared so to do this first of all we need to square our ages so 6 squared is 36 12 squared is 144 5 squared is 25 and 7 squared is 49 so if we add these up that will give us sigma x squared so 36 add 144 add 25 add 49 gives a total of 254 so we can now put these three numbers into our standard deviation formula so it is the square root of so sigma x squared is 254 and we're dividing that by n which is 4 minus sigma x is 30 and again we're dividing that by 4 and we need to square that so you should be able to type this in exactly as it appears on a scientific calculator using the fraction key and the brackets okay so let's work this out then Okay, so we get an answer of 2.69 and that is to three significant figures. So I hope you liked the video then guys. If you did, like and subscri subscribe and I'll see you next time. Bye bye.